Hey guys, Joy here, Holistic Nutritionist. So I'm gonna show you how to sprout in three very easy ways. In this video, I'll teach you how to do this, plus I'll talk to you about all the reasons why you want to sprout. So I'm gonna take these mung beans, See these little tiny beans, they're not much to look at, but they are just waiting to turn into a beautiful plant, rich in vitamins and minerals, and it's so easy. So before I started sprouting, I have to admit, I was kind of intimidated by it. I don't know, it seemed like it was something for like tree hugging hippies. By the way, I love all tree hugging hippies. I hug trees. But uh, I just thought, oh no, sprouting, I don't know. I'm dropping mung beans. <laughs> Anyhow, you guys gotta do this because it's so easy. And when you sprout beans, they become alive. And what that means is that anti-nutrients are eliminated. So things like phytic acid, phytic acid is present in all beans and that prevents your gut from absorbing minerals. And also all the enzyme inhibitors are neutralized. So this is why you won't fart when you sprout your beans because they are so much more digestible because your own digestive enzymes can get in there and break down those starches. So sprouting is good. It's what you wanna do. Sprouting is joyous, actually. Let me just show you my sprouts. See, these are my mung bean sprouts. See how pretty they are? They kind of look like, <laughs> what does this look like, Walker? <laughs> they actually kind of look like little sperm, um, but they're crunchy. Anyways, they're delicious. My favorite way to enjoy sprouts is putting them on top of a salad, like this big, beautiful salad right here. You can also toss them in a smoothie, uh, you can just eat them like this because they're very crunchy and delicious and so good for you. So let me show you how to do this in three easy steps. I'm gonna start with mung beans. I love mung beans because they sprout pretty quick. So you can get um, your beans from the grocery store, you can get them from the health food store. So you're just gonna do, by the way, I never measure, I'm just measuring to show you guys. But um, you're gonna do about four tablespoons of sprouts in your big mason jar. Four tablespoons is around a quarter of a cup, I believe. So here, we got our mung bean sprouts. Now we're gonna fill it up with water. Use filtered water, so excuse me for a moment. I'm just gonna get the water, filtered water out of my tap here. Use glass, by the way, don't use plastic. So I'm filling the water all the way up to the top. like so. Now all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave this on my counter overnight. That's step number one. Mung beans in, water in, let's sit. Okay, step number two. Step number two, you've let it sit overnight. Now you're going to drain the water from the seeds. So I just use my nut bag, which I apologize is stained with turmeric. So you could use a cheesecloth, just basically anything that allows you to drain the water without pouring out your seeds. So just put an elastic over top and I'm just gonna show you over here. Can you see that, Walker? We're pretending this is overnight. So we're just pouring the water out. Then you're gonna fill it up with some more water again. Just because you wanna, you wanna rinse them. You wanna rinse and swirl. This is the fun part. So this is what you do twice a day, like this. But you don't let your sprouts sit in water all day. Only the first night do you let them sit in water. So I swirl it around, I dump it out, and then you can just put it beside your sink. You can have it propped up. There are, there's definitely sprouting kits you can get that you know you don't have to use a, a mason jar, but I'm just using it because it's easy, right? So you know what I actually do? I take my husband's bag of coffee beans and I put it under like this. See, on a little angle so it can drain the water out. And the third step is the easiest one, you just sit and wait. So remember, you rinse and swirl two times a day until you get your sprouts. Mung beans, as I mentioned earlier, I like mung beans because they sprout pretty quickly. You're gonna have these beautiful sprouts in like two to three days to put in your salad, to put in a smoothie. 
So after your two to three days when you have your beautiful little sprouts, I want you to remind yourself that these are total superfoods. They're like, first of all, sprouting seeds are so cheap. But second of all, and most importantly, they are so rich in nutrients, rich in vitamins A and B complex vitamins, so good for energy, vitamin K. Uh, when you eat live foods like this, believe me, you're gonna find that your energy definitely increases. Rich in minerals like magnesium and calcium, so very important for bones, potassium important for heart health, and rich in amino acids. I know all of you who care about the protein out there, you're gonna love this because when you sprout beans, the amino acids become very, very easily digested. Are we zooming in on one right here? <laughs> so there you have it, guys. You know all the health benefits, you know the three easy steps. I hope you try it. Give me a thumbs up if you like my video, subscribe, ask me your questions, comment below. I love hearing from you and I hope you have a joyous day. Bye.